She's got power, but she's also got a wrench, idiot light coming on, which probably means the batteries are shot like the lady told me. But, yeah, just going through some testing modes and all. And, uh, had this hooked up probably for me eight hours, nine hours, something like that. Gonna leave it on some more. Yeah, it came up with an orange light saying it was still charging, but at least the unit's powering up, getting some kind of charge in there. And, uh, maybe now that I got more of a charge in there, I can, uh, throw my 10 amp, uh, battery charger on there independently on both, on, uh, one battery at a time and charge them up to unplug all the Anderson connectors and just charge the batteries individually. But, uh, yeah, let's see what happens. Uh, looking promising. Yep. Anyway, watch this when I plug it up. You know, for the life of me, I could not figure out where you charge this thing at. I looked all over this part of it, you know. I said, there's no charging port. I had to go look through the manual and finally found out, you charge it at the joystick, which only makes sense. Somebody handicapped it, not going to want to, you know, uh, plug it in the bottom of the unit. Plug it right there where it's easy to get to. But it's, it's throwing an orange light. Uh, this one here might not looks like it's showing up more yellow on my camera, but you know, orange charging. Wish it show a green light and fully charged, but hey, he is paid for something that's free, right? Mr. George, the shade tree fix it man, what do you expect for free? But uh, my next step is to. Uh, after this, and if it don't work, I plan on, uh, what am I going to say? Yeah, plan on trying uh, two riding lawnmower batteries. Because I got one in the red eye, red eye of my play toy. And it's, I never had no trouble with it. I don't ever have to charge it. Got a new one in my grass cutter. And uh, so I'll try them two batteries in here. And they hook in series, which... Uh, you know, two 12 volt batteries in series gives you 24 volts. And this is a 24 volt charger here. But what I'll do, what I might also try is unplugging the batteries and independently charging them uh, with a regular 10 amp battery charger I got. Well, that's it on this update. It's a work in progress, right? Y'all take care. See ya.